Yo, what is up guys? So for today, we're going to be talking about Outriders. If you guys don't know, it's basically a third person shooter that for some reason people are saying reminds them of Destiny. I personally do not see that. I see more Anthem vibes than anything else, but I don't think it's fair to compare this game to Anthem considering this game actually looks fun. Uh, Anthem did not look fun to me and I was right. <laughs> this game looks fun in my opinion. It looks promising but if you're gonna ask me tony are you excited for outriders uh what are your opinions on it like what do you think i'm gonna tell you pretty much every every time someone asks me about a third person shooters i don't care about third person shooters to be honest i think they're weak and they just lack immersion for me now what do i mean by that uh let me first start off by saying this game looks beautiful, looks fun, and is a looter shooter. And it looks like it's an actual looter shooter and not lying. It, this is gameplay, apparently. And I say apparently because you might never know, but I'm going to give them the benefit of the doubt. And if this is gameplay, this looks fun. This looks like something I would, I would play with my friends. Now, this is pretty much where the video is going to become my opinion so obviously if you think this looks fun fuck it dude play it be my guest shit looks fun it's just that for me i don't think th third person shooters are the go-to for shooters in my opinion and i know this is coming from like oh well there's gears of war there's like the last of us there's a bunch of pvp web games that do well or pve as well and I'm not saying that's not true. It's just me personally, I can't get into third person shooters. And I'm not saying third person shooters are bad or that you should, that you're stupid for liking them far from it. It's just a taste. It's my personal taste that I've never really gotten into third person shooters as much as I have gotten into the first person shooters. You can give me a very mediocre first person shooter and I will take it over the best third person shooter because I know the immersion for the first person most of the time will be better than the third person shooter. Now, with all of that being said, will I be playing this game? Most likely, uh, most likely I'll be playing this game just to check it out. It's a looter shooter, which means it immediately grabbed my attention. If it has PVP, I probably will never touch it because my problem with third person PVP games is they just give you a lot of free information for no work at all and what i mean by that is you could just hug a corner and basically find out if there's anyone there or not which is basically how everyone played and remember this is coming from a guy who grew up in the ps3 era of gaming so i played pretty much the highlight of third person shooter pvp games dead space 2 had one Fucking Last of Us had one. And obviously I'm forgetting stuff here and there, but I played a lot of third person shooters growing up. So it's probably me just getting bored, but I know it's because I value first person shooters a lot more, honestly. So with all this being said, I will play it, but I don't think I'll play it for long term, unless the game is that fun that I just kind of don't care about the third person element if it doesn't have pvp i don't really mind it honestly mostly because if the game is that good then people will play it for years borderlands 2 is a perfect example did not have pvp but people still played it for years and years and years so if this game can promise borderlands 2 level of like loot fun and all of this other shit then this game will survive and I will most likely play it. I'll probably get to the point where I beat the game and probably mid-max a little here and there. But again, third person shooters are just really not my style. First person shooters are really something I like more. And in the next video where I talk about the comparisons to Destiny 2, I just don't think that it's there. I don't think it's valid, but that's for that video. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. I want to say i'm excited for this game but i just don't think that's fair because i'm not uh i saw the game i saw the trailer and i was like that's pretty cool i would play it would i 
post content on it? Probably, but I just... I'll give you a good example. I'm really excited for some, like, the next expansion for Destiny 2, uh, Cyberpunk. There's other stuff that I'm really excited for, like, another game is the new expansion for World of Warcraft. I'm really excited for that. This game does not excite me, but to be fair, this game has something that the other games don't, where this one is its something new. It's, uh, it's a new IP. We haven't seen anything like it. So that's why I'm not excited because I just lack the faith that this game will live up to the expectations that everyone has. But uh, that being said, it could totally shut me up and be the most amazing game of 2020. Probably not Cyberpunk because I think Cyberpunk is gonna win, hopefully. But personally, I just don't know if I will be all over it. So yeah, let me know what you guys think. Uh, are you guys excited for Outriders? Let me know in the comments below. If you guys wanna follow me on my social media outlets, things are in the description below. Thank you everyone for the constant support. I really do appreciate it. And other than that, I will see you guys later.